Hi guys, straight to the point. Now, if you wanna, like this footage I brought in here, if I play it back, you see it just jars in. Typically you want to fade in, right? I say I stop this and I bring in a cross dissolve. So you see it fading, cool stuff. But you can be dragging cross dissolve every time. There's a built-in nifty shortcut in DaVinci Resolve for this. Now for this particular video, as I increase the video height, I delete this cross dissolve. To achieve the same effect, I just drag this thing here. And this thing only shows when you increase the height of the video. So now we have the same effect as the cross dissolve. You can use it to fade into multiple sections of this. Let's say I decided to cut this here. Let's bring this here, cut it here. And then I drag this up here. Drag this down. Let's increase the video height of this. And I do the same thing here. But for this feature, I can reverse the... So I can go here and you see we have something nice here. It fades in. You can use the same effect on audio but you have to increase the height of the audio track and then you just drag this like so but there's another additional setting for the audio you can change the slope of the audio with maybe mouse over that white point and drag if you drag it down like this it means it's going to slowly increase it up to this point it now ramps up quickly that's basically it for this just a quick shot one straight to the point you get to see what this can do so instead of bringing it across the solve or going to audio to do all that you can do that straight away on the timeline see you on the next one cheers